New at 11, good news about students doing good work. Kids at Miwok Middle School in Sacramento built solar notebooks to help fellow students in Nigeria. ABC 10 was there as they put their science skills to the test for a good cause. Building solar notebooks, not just a lesson in science and technology, but also a lesson in compassion. You're watching students at Miwok Middle School in Sacramento this week, putting their STEM skills to the test to help some friends in need overseas. I think a lot more people should start like helping the kids, and I feel like that, that way they would have more opportunities. It's all thanks to a labor of love from one local teacher. My husband and I have a nonprofit called Wazubia Arts, and we bring West African cultural arts into the classrooms. They connect students here in California with her husband's family's hometown in Nigeria, bringing learning and gifts to students. You're looking at pictures from their recent visit to personally deliver supplies to the 100 students, all from the local village of Iwato. They have one classroom that has desks and no electricity, no plumbing, no, um, you know, no resources. It's a little village about two hours away from Benin City that's very remote, no markets, you know, most of the kids don't have electricity. So in this, with this toolkit, the solar notebook, um, they can have a little portable charger that plugs into a light. Local organizations donated the supplies and a professional from SMUD guided the students in building the solar notebooks. They were thrown into the, into the process and um, had to do some critical thinking and, and working on their own. And it was really fun yes. doing it as well because it was something new. I've never done it before. Students at other Sacramento schools also made pencil pouches and wrote pen pal letters. You know, our, our main goal is really to empower students, to show them how they can take their learning and use it in a meaningful way to educate others. About Next, organizers are trying to get a well dug at the school in Nigeria. It'll provide running water to the school and neighbors, many of whom were told must walk miles to get water every day from water trucks. They're also fundraising for playground equipment and basic school supplies. If you'd like to help, we have a link on our website, abc10.com. Just click on this story.